And Stilgar certainly is the man we need. Paul, I've studied the weapons here. Interesting, really. I think that now I can train some Fremen in the same way as I taught you before we came here. Bring me to a siege where I can teach the Fremen our art of combat. Paul, I've studied the weapons here. Interestingly. Okay, Paul, I'm going with you. If you like, I can stay here to train these Fremen in the handling of arms. Good, I'm going to try to teach these Fremen in the handling of arms. I'm teaching the Fremen my art of combat. They're learning. Something, Something terrible, terrible has happened in the, the palace. palace. Something. Have you seen the message in the communication room? Leto is really upset. Talk to him. Devastated a siege to show you what will happen to you. Dune is my planet, and I intend to keep it that way. The Baron Harkonnen, a longtime enemy of ours, always capable of the worst atrocities. This crime cannot go unpunished. I'm planning a punitive expedition with my personal guard. I'm sure Thupir Hawat will agree with this. I'm doing my best to help you, Paul, but sometimes you have... So this is what we're up against. Something must be done. Here are our current stocks of spice. The Duke is losing his temper. It's still too early to attack the Harkonnens from the front. Moreover, wait, a new message has arrived. Look at the new message before we continue. We have finished our prospecting job. Just a bunch of punks. Did you intend to frighten the great Harkonnens with them? You haven't a chance. You will soon die. These Fremen of yours, they're just a bunch of punks. This Fade Routh Harkonnen, he is really insane. Watch out, Paul. He may be very dangerous. Soon our Fremen will be formidable warriors. The Harkonnens are very numerous in the area north of the palace, and they're heavily armed. Now, if we have to attack, it would be better in Stilgar's native area, Ergsen. The Hark, go and tell this to the Duke. He may listen to you. Tupir Hawat is overprudent. I'll never run away from these. It's no use insisting. I have made up my mind. I'm going to leave as soon as my guard is ready. And you, Paul, must stay here and continue what you have begun. You're doing well, and I'm proud of you. However, if I do not return, I hope that you will remember me as a good father, and as a duke who showed courage in the face of danger. 
I know you did everything you could to stop him. I'm afraid nothing could be done to prevent his decision. Stop worrying. You must continue on. Impressive powers. I understand that you're worried about your father. He will return, but life goes on here. The Fremen I see often complain about worm attacks. The worms arrive suddenly and attack the harvesters. Paul, you have to get some ornies. It has come to my attention that in the villages there are smugglers who trade equipment and other items for spice. Here are our current stocks of spice. You can notice that yesterday our spice production was better than the day before. The Emperor will call for a spice shipment tomorrow. Fremen live in sieges. The villages were made by immigrants. Fremen don't usually go to villages. We don't even know their locations very well. Soon our Fremen will be formidable warriors. The Harkonnens are very numerous in the area north of the palace, and they're heavily armed. I want a shipment of spice today. We can send him what he asked for, as we currently have enough spice in stock. Okay, Paul. Let's go to the... Good. Let's go. The spice has been shipped. Now let's wait for the Emperor's reaction. We don't have to worry. We've sent what he asked. Ah, the answer has just come. Let's have a look at this message. You sent me the spice I've asked for. Good. Next shipment will be six days from now. My troop is going to attack a fortress. We've captured these little spines of yours. You don't stand a damn chance against us. My troop is attacking this fortress. Here are the characteristics of my troop. There is so much confusion among the Harkonnens, it's going to be easy to rout them. These Harkonnens, we've got many of them. No Fremen have been killed. Would you like me to repeat what I said? My troop is attacking this fortress. My troop is attacking this fortress. Have a look at the characteristics of my troop. There is so much confusion among the Harkonnens, it's going to be easy to rout them. I have to report the loss of some of my men, but we killed more Harkonnens. Would you like me to repeat what I said? Wadi? My troop is attacking this fortress. My troop is attacking this fortress. Have a look at the characteristics of my troop. There is so much confusion among the Harkonnens. Some of our people have been killed, but we definitely killed more Harkonnens. Would you like me to repeat what I said, Wadid?
Yahoo! We won the battle, Muad'Dib. And Lulu. Good to see these Harkonnens beaten off. Our Fremen are good warriors. And you are a great leader of men. If you like, I can stay here to train. Good. I'm going to try to teach these Fremen the handling of... We've won the battle, Muad'Dib. We're transforming this ugly fortress into a nice siege. You'll see. I've never been to a village. I remember a tale about the village in the fish's mouth. Hmm? I'm still ready to follow you. Look at the new message before we continue. A shipment of spice today. Paul, you have to get some ornies. Here are our current stocks of spice. You can notice that yesterday our spice production was better than the day before. The Emperor asked for a spice shipment, didn't he? We can send him what he asked for, as we currently have enough spice in stock. Okay, Paul, let's go to the communication room at once, and- Good, let's go. I'll stay here. The spice has been shipped. Now let's wait for the Emperor's reaction. We don't have to worry. We've sent what- Ah, the answer has just come. Let's have a look at this message. Searching new messages. Message from the Emperor Shaddam IV. You sent me the spice I've asked for. Good. I'll call you again in seven days. Soon our Fremen will be formidable warriors. The Harkonnens are very numerous in the area north of the palace, and they're heavily armed. Now, if we have to attack, it would be better in Stilgar's native area, Ergsen. The Harkonnens there are very far from the Arakin palace. The Harkonnen weak spot is there. I am worried about these Harkonnens. Now that they know what we're doing, they will surely try to infiltrate some of their men among our troops. Beware of sabotage, Paul. Anyway, you surely must be able to attack some remote Harkonnen fortresses by now. Still be very careful. Select destination on the desert. It looks like a village, there on the left. have the eyes of a Fremen now, Wadib. There are no Fremen troops here. This smuggler looks strange, don't you think? Here you are. The best place on Dune to buy all kinds of equipment. 
You name it, I have it. Well, let me see if I have something for you. I have a spice harvester for trade. Here is my price for it. You've got a deal. It's a pleasure to do business with you. It's yours now. Send well. Let me see if I have... I have an Orny for trade. Here is my price for it. You've got a deal. It's a... It's yours now. Well, let me see if I have something for you. I have nothing to trade at the moment. Sorry. Try coming back here again soon. I always see shadows at night. I'm tired of all these travels with you, Pa. I want to go back to my place. Tuano Timon. I'm tired of all these travels with you, Pa. There are no Fremen troops here. Tuano Timon. You'd better talk with the Fremen chiefs. Thank you, Paul, for bringing me here. Paul, I was waiting until Hara wasn't with us. I have something to tell you. I'd like you to meet somebody. I think it's important for you. I want us to go to Oxtine Tabor, west of the village we found. I've indicated it on your map. you, Paul Atreides. You respect our people. We've waited for a man like you for a long time. I was born here and love this planet. Have you seen the desert at night? It's so beautiful. These deserted sieges, they always make me sad. Oh, I love telling you about my native world. I was born here and love this planet. Have you seen the desert at night? It's so beautiful. <sighs> the desert. You, uh, may I call you Paul? Oh, Paul, <laughs> this moment is unique. Being here next to you with all these worlds above us. I want to be close to you. It's so good to be near you. I. Uh, I think I fall in love with you. I want to be with you every day. Oh, this is so... Chinese help, you will soon be a real Fremen Wadi, a Fremen leader. I've never been in love before, Paul. You're quite a remarkable man. There's still some unused equipment here. By the way, remember there's a message for you in the communication room. Oh, Paul, <laughs> this moment is unique. Being here next to you with all these worlds above us. I want to be close to you. If you want to meet more Fremen, we can go to the sieges I know. One of them is deep in the south. Oh, I love telling you about my native world.
I was sure you were coming. It's terrible. The Duke is dead. He was killed by the Harkonnens. Zufir will give you all the details. It's terrible. Paul, I tell you, these Harkonnens are beasts. They're completely without mercy. As far as I know, the Duke and his guard didn't have much chance to fight. The transportation ornaments were spotted by the Harkonnen troops and shot down. Paul, we have to find another means of transportation if we want to beat these Harkonnens. I wonder how the Fremen have done it in the past. Let's go to another room. I have something to tell you. Paul, for you, worms mean danger. As a matter of fact, they do attack harvesters and men sometimes. But, as incredible as it may sound to you, Fremen use worms to travel in the desert. We ride them. I guess you should be able to now ride a worm, Paul. Let's go out into the desert. Yes, Paul. You can ride the worm. I miss Leto. He's been a good father to you. Don't ever forget that. As incredible as it may sound to you, Fremen use worms to travel in the desert. We ride them. I guess you should be able to now ride a worm, Paul. Select destination on map. Hotstein Islands. Paul, you have now perfected the riding of the worm. You now know almost everything about the Fremen. Why don't you tell Thufir Howard about the worm? Paul, you have now perfected the riding of the worm. These Fremen do have surprises. Riding worms seems incredible. This could be the perfect way to go to the Harkonnen fortresses. That's an advantage for sure, but I've been thinking. We still lack something. Something that would turn the balance. Something that the Harkonnens can't imagine, even in their most pessimistic plans. Don't ask me what. I don't know. Maybe you could find it. My feeling is that the answer is here, in this very palace. Hmm? You understand all of this. You're doing a great job, Paul. Hmm. I wish Leto was here. He would be so proud of you. So... Thufir told you about something hidden in this palace. Yes. Yes. 
It is possible. So, Ufir told you about something hidden in this palace. We both will try to examine the few rooms we can access. Go ahead. I'm following you. I'll stay here. I feel nothing particular in this room. 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 I've just found a hidden door here on the right. Oh my! I can't find words. A greenhouse here on Dune. Look at all that water. Water on Dune. Can you imagine that? Oh my! Oh, this is so beautiful. Even my father doesn't. Did I tell you about my father? I'm the daughter of Liet Kynes, the planetologist. I'd like you to meet him. I understand now. That's what Stilger had in mind when he introduced you to me. Anyway, let's go. I'll show you the way. First, we go to Oxton Tabor. I'd prefer Stilgar to come along with us. Oh, I love telling you about my native world. Oh my! I'm staying here. Hmm? Yes, Muadim. I am with Select destination and... This is the place where we met, Paul. Remember? Now we must go westwards. The siege where my father lives is beyond the rocky line. These deserted sieges, they always make me sad. Select destination on map. Desert, westward. It looks like a siege. There, on the left. Let's enter. Ah, my dear daughter Shandy. Yes, father. I brought someone for you to meet. I see. Stilgar didn't tell me, but I thought you should meet him. It would be interesting to tell him about your experiment. Perhaps it could be. He's a great leader. He's already discovered many sieges and has rallied many troop chiefs. You're right, both of you. I will show him everything I know. You've seen this planet, a big desert. Outer world's people think of it only as a spice reservoir. But people here love their home world, and they would like it to be more habitable. I'm involved in vegetation experiments, a vegetation that would grow in the sand. I came to create a new kind of bulb. I've got some of them here. Come in the next room with me. As 
you can see, these bulbs are almost ready. They still need a little more care. What I would need is to have some Fremen troops to help work on them. I know some local sieges. Go and try to convince them to work with me. Oh yes, water. Go to the room on your left, you'll see. You are the first non-Doom-born person allowed to see this, Paul. There are many caches like this one, Paul. It's the old Fremen dream. Vegetation on Arrakis. There is very slight humidity in the air on Arrakis. We use a wind trap to extract it, and it comes down and gathers here. We also have little quantities of the very special water of life. It is used by our few reverend mothers. The water of life extends consciousness. But only a few people are able to absorb it and live. Would you like to try it, Muad'Dib? Your decision frightens me, Muad'Dib. Drink it if that's your will. such a fright, Mwadiba. You've been unconscious for three hours. I don't know what the water of life has done to you. I'm not exactly expert in these matters. I cannot see any change in you now. The old Fremen dream. Vegetation on doom. We have the water. Have you seen the big reservoir here? And Kynes has bulbs. Vegetation could be a weapon against the Harkonnens. Where there are plants, there cannot be spice. The only element the Harkonnens want. There are many caches like this one, Paul. It's the old Fremen dream. Vegetation on Arrakis. There is very slight humidity in the air on Arrakis. We also have little quantities of the very special water of life. It is used by our few. The old Fremen dream. Vegetation could be a weapon. There are no Fremen troops here. Paul, I was so frightened when you were drinking the water of life. What has it done to you? Oh, I love telling you about my native world. As you can see, these bulbs are almost ready. They still need a little more care. What I would need is to have some Fremen troops to help work. I know some local sieges. There is a strange disease here. Everybody is ill here. We need help. Everybody is ill here. I'm teaching the Fremen my art of combat. They're learning. Paul, you are the only man able to make these strange disease we have here. Very strange. I wouldn't be surprised if the Harkonnens were behind all this. But I'm sure I can cure this disease. All I need is time. Strange indeed. Okay, Paul. I'm staying here to cure the Fremen. I guess that it will take me at least a couple of days. Okay, Paul. I'm staying here to cure... Good to see these Harkonnens beaten off. In the matter of diseases, Chani is far more qualified than I am. I'm teaching the Fremen my art of combat. They're learning quickly. Paul, you are the only man able to make these Harkonnen step back. I'm proud to be at your side. Strange disease, but I'm sure I can cure this disease. I'm working on it now. But 
Please, Paul. Don't stay here or I won't get anywhere. 